This is an Aspen Now shortcut. Today we're going to show you how to set a default font for an HTML field and we're going to show you a couple of examples. Right here what you'll see is I'm creating a knowledge base article and if you look at the article body you'll see it's not your standard out of the box font. It's an Arial 12 point. We can access the default value by right clicking on the article body and clicking configure dictionary. To configure the actual default value, here's the code snippet that we're going to put in to make this Arial 12 font happen. Also, one thing to note is that we are in the advanced view, so make sure that you're in the advanced view of the dictionary entry. Another way that we could get there is to go to the dictionary and then look up the title of the field along with the type, which is HTML. We'll take a look at two other examples. One is coming from the plan task table and it is a font family of Arial Black and Sans Serif. And again, we're in the advanced view. And then here's our third example, which is on the RM story table. This one is Courier New. Both of the fields I just displayed are on the story form. So we'll go to create a new story. Type in a short description, which is mandatory. And now let's navigate to HTML description. We'll see it's Arial Black and the acceptance criteria is Courier New. I will type in some values in each of the fields and now we'll click Save just to make sure that it works. And voila, we have a polished gem. In order to get the default values for each of the code snippets, I came to this site here, W3Schools, and then I plugged in the values for the font family and in the default field for the dictionary entry. Thank you for watching today's video. Click like if you learned something and don't forget to subscribe. My name is Jason Miller, founder of Aspenow Solutions and we've just unlocked the power of ServiceNow.